we really wanted to create a space where you really didn't have to think about cancer. You didn't have to think about doctor's appointments or you didn't have to think about your next treatment. But cancer camp really is everyone coming together. You don't have to talk about why you're tired or why you feel fatigued because we all know because we've been there. I've done rock climbing, I've done writing, I'm excited to do painting, bonfires are fun, s'mores are fun. I actually had did not follow the schedule. I didn't look at the schedule once exactly while I was here. If you want to be busy all day, you definitely can. If you want to relax, you can, you can do that, yeah. It's what you make it. The flexibility of the programming allows us to do some activities when we fill up to it, but also we have the option to rest and recuperate when we need to. They would sometimes even extend certain activities so we can make sure to take advantage of everything. The food is amazing. I honestly can't believe how they've accommodated everybody in terms of eating habits, and I'm a vegetarian and I don't feel like I'm called out, which is not a normal thing. The rock climbing wall was amazing. I was terrified because I'm pretty scared of heights, but it was really cool to be able to do something that I wouldn't be able to normally do. I'm able to just connect with people. It's so open and freeing. I think just being able to have a great community amongst the two agencies to um, help lift each other up has been probably my favorite part. Well, I really am enjoying the archery and hanging out over there, and I'm very excited to test out the slip and slide and being with people who understand what everybody's going through here. I really enjoyed the writing classes. I've always enjoyed things like that. I took advantage of the art class yesterday, and I think I'm gonna do that again later today. I just looked at the activities that were available and signed up for the ones that I liked best. It's nice to be able to get here and connect with people who you know, have had a similar experience and who have gone through what I went through and just you know, have some good old-fashioned conversation and connecting about it. This whole weekend has been reconnecting, just laughing, having fun, and just being able to not worry about like what I say or what happens when. Meeting people within the you know same um, age range as myself under that young adult category, that's going to stick with me. I haven't had much interaction with fellow you know young adult um, cancer patients or survivors. Sometimes people don't even get this atmosphere. They've never been camping. They've never been on a campus where you can canoe or you can do air rifles. You can do so many different activities and then still connect with your people. My favorite part so far this weekend is just getting to meet in person all of the people that I've become really close to over the last two or three years through virtual events. It's a beautiful location. Um, this is my first time spending a significant amount of time in Pennsylvania. Everyone's been really welcoming and the facilities are great. And I just really enjoy doing the activities and making the memories that do actually last for years. You can just chill and relax and catch up with a friend or, you know, do an activity right on your own or just go off into the woods if you want to and reflect on your own. No matter how scared you are to give this a try, know that there's gonna to be tons of people here that were once like you. It's just a great time. Good to hang out with all these people who understand. I've had a good time, all of it. Yeah, I'm trying to do it all.